Hello, two minute preview here from the iPro Stadium, or if you want to call it Pride Park. We're supposed to do that from, from January apparently. You see, it's an absolutely stunning day. Look at it, blue skies. There is the stadium. It's a cracking place to come and uh, watch some football, providing you get some decent football. And of course, Norwich City need to produce some decent football if things are not going to get um, even more awkward than they've been in recent weeks. And uh, fear not, we will all be giving our honestly held opinions as to how this all unfolds. But uh, the teams are out. There are a few changes. Some of the old faces are back in. We've got Nace, uh, Stephen Naismith and Wes Hulahan starting today. So a bit of a regression back to what Norwich City were doing at the very start of the season. This is clearly a big opportunity for uh, the pair of them to prove that they can play together at somewhere you know where they're going to come up against a very informed side Derby will play three up top they've got a lot of dangerous players who are in good form Tom Ince is free scoring and also of course Bradley Johnson is starting today and uh, he will probably love nothing more than to prove a point against his old teammates and the manager who sold him however of course well they get on now uh, Alec Neal is in charge I imagine there's a few people who probably thought that Alec Neal wouldn't be in charge this afternoon but he is he's had all that backing and to be honest even if it doesn't go that well for him this afternoon we will we may well have him in charge come the game at Brentford at Carrow Road I guess what they've said all week is that they have it in them to change this run around and they can do that and then everything will be fine that's literally the message we're getting um, from the club so we just await seeing that on the pitch Norwich need to be out there and they need to look like they're playing for the manager and for themselves but you do worry about the defence obviously Norwich are missing Martin Olsen uh, through suspension and Graham Dorans they have uh, Robbie Brady uh, Ryan Bennett uh, Sebastian Bassong and, and, Mar and uh, Russell Martin in the back four ahead of John Ruddy and two holders in terms of Alex Tetty who's back after his suspension and Yusuf Malumbu is back after being fit so that's two proper holding midfielders that Nor Norwich will have in the middle which will of course the aim will be to counter uh, Derby's three up front but uh, this is a tough ask and to be honest I just can't see it going well but you know they've surprised us before and they'll surprise us again I'm sure and all the Norwich fans as you can see getting ready for the game